Here we go, Darth Wizzy Wizard coming at you with another haul. Look what I was able to pick up. Toys R Us pickup, Boba Fett, Tatooine, this is the Deluxe. We didn't have any of the other TV season there, just a bunch of Landos, which look nice. I don't know why, how many Landos do I gotta buy? I'm waiting for them to go on sale, I'll buy them all with everybody picked up this beautiful retro figure not bad condition i think there's a little nick on this one or whatever um these all come up with these little necks i mean they had uh, they had them all there pretty much all the different colors but i don't know i went with this one i don't know maybe i should have gone the yellow or the purple i was tempted to pick up more but i don't know somebody tell me in the comments am i crazy they are nice though they look good but i don't know i just I, like i can't just buy six of each color like what a waste of and then where are you going to display them all i mean should i collect them i don't even know anyways went to walmart and they had nothing but this pack in they had some of the retro obi-wan series in there which i have zero interest in and i had to get the e-web Canon. This was a great scene. So I picked up two of them. They were in good condition. I think they had about five or six of these in there. But still, that's like that's like 75 bucks right here. The Toys R Us was asking like 44 bucks for this. Yeah, I'm not even kidding you. Like this is not a $44 figure, I don't think. And what does it come with? Like I don't know, like maybe 30 bucks? Like I don't know, should I even bought that? I forget what this was, but it's like 25, 26. Like, it's cool, but I don't know the prices. Oh my God, inflation. It's killing. But anyways, I was really happy to get to the, this was the one I really wanted. I mean, obviously this is a fantastic figure too, but it's weird how Toys R Us had this figure, yet Walmart had these ones in. I don't know what the distribution is I can't keep up with, uh, you know, what's a deluxe, what's not, or what's, sorry, what's an exclusive, but uh, anyways, there it is, Navarro Cantina, so I do have the Navarro Cantina, so happy to get these, uh, they did have a Costco Reeves, but uh, on the figure, or the card back, it had some scratches here, scratches, it was scratched up, and I don't know. For the money that they're asking, I think it was like 26 bucks. I was just like, I'd rather wait till that's like on sale if I'm going to open it, you know, but I don't know. Hard to say. I only got into one Toys R Us, one Walmart. There's another Toys R Us that's close. It was only about 30 minutes away, actually less than that, which I bet you had an even better selection. I wanted to get the Stormtrooper too, but... Uh, you know, I try to get one of these each. Like, I wouldn't mind picking up that Vader eventually. But there's Vader, the Stormtrooper. Uh, I think those are the two I don't have. I don't know. I think they got, like, four of these now. So I've got Boba Fett and Chewbacca. But uh, anyways. So all I need is Soka of this. And then I've got the three-pack. I think that's it. I can't even remember. There's... Remember remember because there's so many different uh stuff that's coming out it's all over the place but anyways i couldn't pass this up to be honest with you truth be told even though i'm always honest i'd love to see the uh an empire strikes back version of this with the snow trooper storm trooper and hoth gear winter gear that would be a a beautiful empire strikes back one but anyways there it is Cheers to the next uh, video. I won't be getting too much. I don't think I've had anything really. I've canceled all my pre-orders. So the only figures I'm looking for now is uh, Din Djarin, um, the Morak one. Uh, what's his name there? Bill Burr. I would like to get his figure. The Costco Reeves, even though I had it in hand, I was going to buy it. That's another uh, TVC. Uh and uh, the figure in Dan, when that comes out, 
but you know, I'm just, I've decided just to go the BOE route and uh, pick up stuff as I find it and as I see it. And if it's in stock, it's there. If it's not, unless it's something I really want, I'm not gonna, you know, travel to the other end of the world to get it or pay scalper prices anymore. Not that I really was doing that, but still, it does add up. Anyways, stock market crashed 1,300 points today on the Dow. So, looks like we're definitely coming into the recession, so. But I couldn't pass up these. So, anyways, cheers to the next video.